Initial setup and pre-start inspection. The first task when setting up any portable pump is to assure that the unit is level and on solid ground. If the pump is trailer mounted, be sure that the leveling and support jacks are down and in the locked position. Be sure that the pump is secure and do not place the pump near the edge of a ditch or excavation. Remember to keep your suction lift to a minimum. For best results, we recommend that you limit the suction lift to 25 feet. Check the ground for potential obstacles in the path of hoses or pipe. Check the condition of the suction and discharge hoses and all gaskets, threads, and fittings. Before installing the discharge hose, check the discharge priming valve for any obstruction which would prevent it from opening, closing, or sealing properly. Before installing the suction hose, check the impeller for obstructions. Support the hose or piping as needed to ensure an even slope up to the pump. For best results, the quick connects should be tightened at the 12 and 6 o'clock positions. Lastly, ensure fittings are facing the proper direction and the correct elbows are in position. Prior to starting the engine, please read the engine manufacturer's operating, use and maintenance manual. Check the engine oil, the radiator coolant, and the fuel in the tank. Make sure that all guards, shields, and other safety devices are in place and are in good condition. Confirm that the pump volute drain valve is closed. Now that the engine pre-startup checks have been completed, the engine can be started.